Marshalls are clear of the grid. Flick those switches, pull those gears. Here we go, ready to race. It's, it's hard to tell, but personally, if I'm if I'm Solberg, Solberg, I would have waited a bit more to Joker. Basically, I'd rather be behind Christopherson and flying on the track than risk to be caught in traffic. I wonder if it's a sign of how much Solberg would like to win it. You see, through the right, absolutely fantastic sound from these cars up and over the jump. Okay, Christopherson's gone now, so Christopherson's gone defensive on the Joker, and he's going to come out where he comes out alongside Hansen, and he's now in behind Hansen too, so Hansen's got a Joker, but Christopherson's got Solberg, and that was the key to this. Exactly, but that, that, that was close for comfort for Christopherson. He really had to back off to make sure Hansen was going clear in front of him. So everybody is joking except for Timmy Hansen out front in the Peugeot, but you can see already the VWs have made up a gap to him. The only thing this does do is makes it a little bit more difficult for the two VWs to gap everyone by a mile. So when Hansen jokers, they will be out in front again. They're not going to be able to stretch their legs like maybe they might. Timmy then will be looking at where he can get a podium ahead of Sebastian Lowe, but the minute is 5.5 seconds, so Timmy, it could go now and release the VWs, and he does. And Solberg never gave up. He's really, really close to Chris Christopherson, so at the first slightest mistake, I think Solberg's going to go for it. OK, well, let's hope for a race then, right the way through to the flag. Oh, the no call that these two guys are very, very close. To There's that trippy left-hander. Those concrete barriers are much tighter than they were last year. Yeah, exactly. They changed the layout a little bit. And by the way, Christopherson doesn't do mistakes, so Solberg's going to hope for it, but it's very, very tough. Christopherson is so cool, isn't he? I mean, you've met him this weekend, and he's just super calm and focused. And Solberg, you see, he moves across, shows himself in the mirrors. He, what's that? Just saying, well, here, the typical road racing maneuver where you fill both mirrors and, and you make the other driver think that you might go on the side of the other. But I don't think uh, Christopherson's going to be afraid by that. By the way, corner two, the wall is much softer than it used to be. So for drivers, it, it, it really helps uh, to, to, uh, to try to outbreak someone for corner two. Solberg running all the way across the road there. Wheels out into the dirt, up against the edge of the barrier. I don't think anybody else is going to stop Christopherson. He's still got a couple of laps to go. And we've got a car going slowly out in the infield. It looks like Timmy Hansen, is it? It is Timmy Hansen pulled over. So it's game over for Hansen. That's a real shame. There's a little bit of uh, under cowling hanging out the bottom of the car. He's off the racing line, so it's not going to affect this one. Christopherson versus Solberg. Now the gap is up to a second. Yeah, Christopherson stepped it up quite a bit. 48.1 for Christopherson, 48.6 the previous day. So he's taken, yeah, he's taken three, four tenths out of Solberg, hasn't he, over the last two laps? just put himself out in front. Christopherson races so much that, that this, it's not a distraction, is it having another car behind him? No, no, I, I, I don't think he's going to see any difference. And it's, it's, you can see a talented driver when he needs to step it up and be quicker for three tenths, and he just does it. 
Chris Dobson has got just two corners to go. He's having an outrageous season. He has made the final every single time. He's had six podiums in a row. That was the record in the World Rallycross Championship, but it is a new record. Seven podiums in a row, and he can celebrate it standing on the top step. Chris Dobson wins in Canada. Solberg is P2, and Sebastian Loeb is P3. But Chris Dobson is absolutely killing it. Chris Dobson takes the win from Solberg and Sebastian Loeb, Kevin Erickson. Haken and look with the Monster Energy Supercharge Award down in P5. Timmy Hansen, unfortunately, DNF, but still gets a point for his efforts.